You all didn't set out to find the best place to retire. You set out to find the most interesting place to retire. What were the criteria for that? Oh, uh, a lot of it starts with our readers. Uh, they, um, they write to us and, and thankfully tell us about some of the interesting places that they're living. And so we're, we're looking for places that are, are really vibrant, uh, that have great places to eat and great places to, to visit and things to do. Um, ideally, we also want to be an affordable community. Um, and want to have great health care, too. Uh, that's uh, just a part of life as we get older. Yes, so those, it, yes. those three things are what we're looking for in a community. Not interesting to live in a place with uh, bad health care, for sure. All right, let's talk about a few of the locations you all nailed down for your 30 best. And again, this is an e-book. People can download it online from the Wall that's Street right. Journal. Uh, I think it's about $3.99, an absolute steal. So first of all, give us one of the most unusual places, Bloomington, Indiana. Bloomington, Indiana, um, a great town. Um, University of Indiana is there. And um, uh, so that, again, that gives you that vibrant uh, feel uh, that so many retirees are looking for. You can go to classes at the University of Indiana and also um, very pedestrian friendly. Most people are riding bikes in Bloomington. Um, we think it's a great place to retire. Always being near university town is good. Health care and the youth factor. What about Oregon? Are you a place I've actually never even heard of. Cannon Beach, Oregon? Cannon Beach, uh, one of the most beautiful spots um, on the West Coast. Um, stunning vistas. Uh, you've probably seen some of the pictures. You don't realize it of some of the rock formations just off the beach uh, and in the water. Uh, but again, a great small town um, and the Northwest, just a, a wonderful place to live. So uh, we think Cannon Beach is a, a great spot for retirees. Now, what about Wyoming? What city there did you pick? I love Wyoming. I love, I love, I love hiking. I love horses. W what is it about? What's the place in Wyoming you nailed down? Uh, we picked Cheyenne, uh, the capital. And um, uh, most people would, uh, would think of a capital city as a, as a bigger town. But Cheyenne has this great small town feel. Um, and, and just a terrific place uh, for outdoor lovers. If you're an outdoor enthusiast, um, Cheyenne, Wyoming is a, is a great place to check out. Abroad, people who may not want to stay in the States, if they're thinking about going abroad, they want to find a place with some of these exact criteria you've been talking about, Glenn, to make it interesting but also affordable from a healthcare standpoint. What do you recommend? Uh, we've got a few uh, recommendations for you. Actually, in today's Wall Street Journal, we. We look at a person who has retired to Costa Rica, um, and she absolutely loves it down there. Very low of cost of living, very affordable, and she loves the health care down there. She finds it's uh, great health care and fits her pocketbook just fine.